<clears throat> um, <clears throat> I'm already apologizing. Sorry for the coughs, the grunts, the sniffs. Um, welcome to the Profit Power Hour. <clears throat> I'm gonna go ahead and get my webcam on. Oh, okay. What's up, everyone? So, um, everybody's piling <coughs> in the room right now. And um, I'm excited to have you here. I might look a little bit sick under the weather, and that's because I still am. Uh, but I wanted to come on here this week and chat with you. Um, you know, welcome all of our new members and uh, recap <clears throat> what we did the week after last. So everybody's kind of piling in right now. You should be able to see our uh, <coughs> our welcome screen. <clears throat> so just put in a one if you could see it. All right, put in a one. Uh, so while while we're doing that, um, I'm going to go ahead and start off by saying I'm not going to go a full hour tonight. I plan to maybe do like a 30 minute recap. Um, if you're if you're new <clears throat> if you're new here, uh, last week was the first time since 2015 that I have actually um, canceled a profit power hour. And it's because I was just terribly ill with some sort of like sinus infection or something. Uh, I'm, I'm not quite sure, you know, what I have. Like it's still, um, <clears throat> it's still lingering. And now my, my wife has it. So, um, and so like we're both still struggling. Um, I'm on a lot of like con decongestants and, all these medicines. Uh, so, you know, I'm feeling really <clears throat> under the weather too. I uh, hate to welcome you all and the webinar telling you how awful I feel, but I just couldn't, <clears throat> I couldn't miss two webinars in a row. I already was upset that last week I, I just, I didn't have a voice. Uh, I, I couldn't do it. Like last week, the issue is I didn't have a voice. And of course I felt awful. Um, but but this week is now I'm I'm just hopped up on meds, and so the meds have me feeling uh, really down. But um, you know I'm assuming that after I get off my antibiotics and everything, next week I will be back on track, <clears throat> and I have something really cool next week uh, to share with you all as well. So that'll be awesome. That's really really cool things um, to share with everyone. So. Um, if you showed up last week and you saw the little sign that said, or image that said, hey, look, sorry, um, the webinar is canceled if you're newer, that this is the message uh, that I had posted uh, right here. All right, so you go back and read this. It, I've literally never missed um, a webinar before and uh thank you all for the comments the 32 of you that commented um i really truly appreciate it i, I i'm feeling much better um it doesn't help that my air conditioner in my bedroom uh, side of my house went out so now i'm sleeping in a really hot room and my throat's messed up so it doesn't make for a really good situation um <clears throat> but that's neither here uh nor there i am here tonight i have a voice um, I'm coughing and stiffing and stuff, but we're gonna get through this. I'm gonna I'm gonna walk y'all through some cool stuff. Talk about something uh, really neat that <coughs> we're uh, we're gonna do next week. All right. So um, the other thing that I wanted to hit is <clears throat> um, I wanted to thank you all for your congratulations. So if you saw this post here, um, you know if you didn't get the message or the memo. Um, I am me and me and my wife Casey. Uh, we've been together a very long time, and we are expecting, and uh, we are so excited. And it is a boy. So if you follow my brother, then um, you know he just had a little girl. I think it was February, if I recall correctly. And uh, that month, we found out that you know we were pregnant, and so um, this is our our 
our uh, gender reveal. No one in the family knew. Um, so that's that's me and Casey. And so you can go check out these photos of us. It's epic because the sky was blue and pink. Uh, what an awesome, uh, <clears throat> awesome shot of the sky. And this is kind of like our reaction when we found out, you know, uh, that it was going to be a boy, you know, boy or girl. So I want to thank you all for the love on this post. I meant to tell you all that last week, but I had, um, you know, canceled the webinar just because I was so ill. So uh, thank you so, so much. I can't wait to go on this journey. I can't wait to 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 meet uh, my son. It feels weird saying that. Um, <clears throat> can't wait to meet him. It's due in December. So it will be a December baby. If, uh, if I'm lucky, I want it to be a November baby because I, I was born in November. It would come like a week or so early. Uh, but yeah, <clears throat> I want to thank you all for that. So now that we've gotten through all that, let's let's get the business. Okay, let's get the business. I'm sorry I'm not as chipper as I usually am, <coughs> but <coughs> um, uh, I, I at least want to walk y'all through because I feel like when there's a week in between what we went over, um, <coughs> people tend to forget. New people come on. So we'll, we'll go through that. I want to tell you about this new opportunity uh, that I'm going to share with you next week that's completely free, um, that is absolutely incredible, that is going to blow your mind. It doesn't require that you sell anything. It doesn't require you spend any money. Um, that's something that I'm blitzing right now. And sometimes as, and we'll talk about this later, but sometimes as an entrepreneur, while you're focused on one thing, uh, short windows of opportunity arise and you have to shift focus, you have to adapt so you can succeed and you can get as much success as you possibly can. So <clears throat> next week I'm gonna show you this and it's gonna blow your mind. But for now, um, at the tip top, you could see my, um, link for Shopify, profitph.com forward slash Shopify. Check it out. Um, that's where you start your free Shopify store for 14 days, all right? Um, underneath that are, are our recommended vendors. So if you uh, go to those links, then you will see that you can quickly access my top rated dropship vendors for print on demand and just general dropshipping products, okay? Now, last week, what we did is we reviewed uh, what a good uh, checkout would look like. And so we, we went through puravita.com. It's a very, very popular uh, e-commerce store. They, they've been on Shopify um, <clears throat> maybe even longer than me. Uh, I, I do think that they have been on Shopify for quite some time. And we talked about some of the the things that, like I outlined things last week, or well, the week before last, that you should do to optimize your website's cart and checkout process, right? So this is your plan to win sales. And one thing that we wanted to do that we knew would help us, um, this is something that can help us, right? is we wanted to have the, the checkout process be simple. You know, the more clinky and clunky it is, the more drop off you're gonna have. So when somebody's trying to pay you, don't make it complicated. It's that simple, right? If I was selling a service <clears throat> door to door, okay, let's just have door to door. I'm interrupting somebody and, I, you know, screw that. Let's just say I go into a store, all right, and I try to buy something. Before I could buy it, they're like, well, we're going to need you to review this agreement. We're going to need you to sign here. Uh, we're actually going to need to take your credit card and write down the number and sh sh that, uh, stamp it so we can enter it later. And the process was long and it was lengthy and it was boring. Or the, the cash uh, person operating the cash register just didn't know what they were doing and they were messing up and having to start over. You might just say, screw it. Like, I don't got time for this. Like, I got things I, 
I've got to do, right? So we want it to be clean and simple. <clears throat> Our checkout should also build trust because as you're asking people for money, you want to um, ensure them that you're legit, it's a safe process, their information is secure. You want to <coughs> have an abandonment responder because people will <clears throat> people will pop off um, and you know just they'll abandon the checkout. You do it, I do it, we've all done it, okay? It's factual, it is data-driven science. Shows that if you send out emails to people once they abandon your shopping cart, within 24 to 48 hours, many of those people are likely to come back and make a purchase. And then <clears throat> we talked about, um, <clears throat> I'm, I'm sorry, uh, <clears throat> the, the, the candy counter upsells. Now, I don't mean counters in like a count. I mean like the counter that you would go up to um, at a gas station or Walmart, right? Um, these are little upsells. These are designed to help you earn, okay? So having these little things on your checkout will help you increase your average order value. And then good shipping options, right? <clears throat> Insured shipping is something that increases conversion rates and increases average order value. Easy payment options. These are things that allow people to quickly pay um, without taking out their credit card. So PayPal, Apple Pay, Shop Pay, Amazon Pay, um, these are all integrations, one click in Shopify that you can apply that can help customers more simply check out, simplify the checkout process <clears throat> and earn. Because let's be honest, typing in your shipping address and then typing in your billing address, typing in your phone number, all that crap, it sucks. Getting your credit card number, then the CVV code, then the expiration date. If you don't have that all memorized, like it sucks. Like I hate, I despise it. I despise doing that. And so do many other people. But being able to leverage, you know, Amazon Pay or Apple Pay or even Shop Pay, um, these are all things that are going to be super beneficial to us and, uh, you know, into our, our checkout process, right? Um, now, the other thing here is. We don't want to re uh, require whoops, people to give us their phone number. When you make people give you their phone number, a lot of them don't want to do it. So they dip out, they don't buy. You can incentivize them to give you your phone number though for a discount. And then you want to have a guarantee, YS section, an urgency timer, and then <clears throat> a payment plan right? So these are the things that we went over that, that you need to apply to your checkout. We we're going to draw these up. I'm going to draw you a map and all that good stuff. But the best place to see it live is Pura Vida. So Pura Vida has many of these things, um, many of these things like integrated. So it's puravitabracelets.com. <clears throat> Sorry, the more I talk, like the worse it gets. Um, <coughs> uh, okay. So first thing is make it check out the checkout process simple. Um, they have Afterpay. So this is something like at the bottom we have. Afterpay is a, a app that you could install. They're a finance company. And so if it allows people to do an interest-free payment plan. So this is going to be super beneficial. Uh, this is going to be super beneficial during like Black Friday, Cyber Monday, um, Christmas holidays. These are all um, <clears throat> these are all going to be good. All right. Um, these are all going to be really good times to uh to really leverage that as people you know they're likely to put stuff on layaway they're likely to uh buy more stuff and, and making a payment plan makes it easier for them to buy more from your store um <clears throat> as we go throughout the the checkout process though it's very simple um the example that we looked over last week 
some of the things that we could see is they had a trust uh, <clears throat> building stuff over here uh, that kind of says, hey, look, you know, this is where we care about uh, the, the, the planet. Uh, we guarantee your happiness and you're going to get a free gift from us. So build trust. Um, <clears throat> the other thing is uh, they have, and it, it already expired, but I'm going to see if I can refresh this. And I know I'm going over what I did two weeks ago. I'm just refreshing y'all because I, I can't do like a full webinar tonight. Um, you can tell my, my voice is even messed up because like the sinuses are hitting. But <clears throat> having a countdown timer, this gives urgency. Um, various shipping options, okay? And if we were to give people our, uh, if we were to give people our, phone number they will incentivize us to do that so um if we choose to give them our phone number then it will give us 20 percent off our next order now i don't know what app does this this could be custom coding uh, <clears throat> shopify's checkout process isn't fully editable unless you're on shopify plus i have never done this I just don't make people give us their phone number. I make it say optional. So this is new, and I'm gonna look into this and see what app does this. Um, but they have Amazon Pay and PayPal. So, you know, it makes it really simple for people to purchase. Um, they have all, they have everything that we they, we really have outlined here. They've got great abandonment cart uh, emails. You if, if you want to have, to be honest, like, if you want to have a successful checkout that is fully optimized, just go copy Pure Vita. Copy what they're doing. They're very successful. And, um, you know, if you're on here two weeks ago, then as I outlined all of this stuff, like I, I, then I was like, oh, well, let's go check out Pure Vita. Um, it was crazy because they already had it all, plus a little more. So I actually built the outline of what you need to have optimized checkout, then randomly went to Pure Vita because I know that they're smart and I know they're a good company and they had it all, plus a little bit more. So go to check out <clears throat> Pure Vita, okay? Um, the, the next step after this, and I'm gonna draw this map out for you of the checkout process, I'm just not gonna do it tonight, but the next step see what we just looked at were these two things we looked at their cart page that's right here where i'm doing the green and we looked at their <coughs> we looked at their order page okay so we looked at those two things last uh week before last and optimize these the next thing is going to be the thank you page where people end up right now where people end up on the thank you page where they get their receipt okay this summary here can be optimized to generate more revenue so if you set up your thank you page the right way um, some using apps and just a little finesse then you're going to be able to create more opportunity, more sales, uh, more fans on Instagram, on, on your fan page, um, on your TikTok account, um, on your YouTube channel. Um, you'll build more trust. You'll get higher average order values of the future. There, this, is, um, <clears throat> this is your essentially The thank you page is like the kiss at the doorstep on your first date at the end of the night, okay? You want it to be good because you want the person to say, I want to do this again. Does that make sense? So you want to give them information you want to give them something special you want to give them a little gift or a discount and it makes them want to come back again if you have like 
an, an awful kiss at the end of your first date, you're probably going to say, that was awful. I don't think I'm going to be calling that person again for uh, round two, right? Um, so, no, I'm not only here trying to teach dating. I'm actually probably really bad at it because I've had uh, a girlfriend and a wife for like so long. Just one. She was my girlfriend, then my wife, not both same time. Y'all know that. Uh, uh, but <clears throat> it's the only analogy I could think of while I'm hopped up on meds, okay? So um, the thank you page is something that we're going to discuss next because it is something that if it is properly utilized, can create more income more, and more revenue from you from your existing customers. And your existing customers are your most valuable asset your existing customers are the ones that are going to come back again and again and again and again and again and uh, <clears throat> and spend more money. And this particular thank you page, um, this particular thank you page, uh, if you do it right, <clears throat> will create what's called those repeat customers. Now, I took a screenshot inside of my Shopify app the other uh, the other day. I'm trying to see. Unfortunately, it shows everybody's information. So, um, <clears throat> okay, I can kind of get their names out. Let me see if it's probably going to be backwards too. I should have thought this out. But this is inside my Shopify app, and it's telling me these customers are expected to spend the most on your store. Um, and, and it's people that have uh, Shopify has noticed continue to come back again and again and again because of my checkout process. So this person with the last name Richards, let's see if I can get this to focus. It's backwards, but spent 397 bucks. Uh, this one underneath us uh, was it Mary? It spent 494 dollars. I know, I know, it's backwards. It's just the way the phone. Um, it's not mirrored. Right, um, and Christine here has spent $208 on my Shopify store. These are existing customers that come back again and again through email, through the thank you page, and through the systems um, you know, that we've put into place. So uh, what I wanna do is next week, I want to I wanna draw the map for you. Like I'm gonna draw the Pura Vida map. We'll call it the Pura Vida map, okay? Um, they're freaking brilliant, Pura Vida is, and always have been. So I've always looked at their store uh, for ideas <clears throat> and whatnot, and they're doing a lot of the stuff I teach, I didn't even know it, right? Um, but I'm gonna draw you the map of this next week. Like I promised you a week and a half, a week ago, two weeks ago, then I was sick last week, and I just can't do it uh, tonight. I don't, I don't think I have the capacity. Um, <coughs> Um, and then also next week, I am going to be showing you a opportunity with a special guest that is is just it's for everyone. Like I would venture to say that if 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 you didn't um, freak out about when I show you what I'm going to show you next week, that you weren't you just were uh, not listening or not paying attention. So I'm going to show you a way to potentially make money without selling anything, no physical product, and without um, putting any money, any of your own money in anything. So it doesn't require an investment and it doesn't require that you sell anything. And it is a great side hustle. It is not a long-term business, okay? Um, because it's a short-term window that, that myself and my brother are taking advantage of right now. I would tell you about it tonight, I just can't. Um, <coughs> but it's crazy. Like our attorney is doing it, like our lawyer. We called him up to ask him if it was legit because we just didn't believe it. And he was like, yeah, I'm already doing this. And I've actually already earned commissions from this so um that are pending so like i gotta show this to you so i'm gonna derail us a little bit 
next week and I'm going to show you something and I promise you that it's not going to cost you any money and you're not going to have to sell anything and the benefits of it that you could potentially realize are massive and it's for it's for anybody it, that zero tech skills zero tech skills so part of our webinar I'm going to talk to you about that and I've actually made a free Facebook group uh, for all of you that want to really blitz this with myself and my bro um, and take full advantage of it and get more free training from us it's not a course it's not a software there's no catch there's no upsell downsell cross sell it's not a funnel it's just a way that you can make money and you could do it without selling anything and without putting a single dime of your money in anything and I've never seen anything like it before. So go ahead next week, put it on your calendar to show up because you're not going to miss it. And when I'm not sick, I'll be able to better explain it to you. And I'm going to give you a free training. I'm going to give you a free link, a free fa private Facebook group. Um, and no, it's not an MLM. It's not a pyramid. It's none of the BS. Y'all know I, I hate MLMs. Like I am not a fan of you put people this leg and that leg and let's just make a big pyramid no I, I mean some people can make money doing those but like I, I i run like a you know real business so i'm not like doing meetings with my cousin and my auntie trying to sell them like a patch they could put on their arm that's supposed to make them feel better like or give them energy while they work out like it's not that okay just show up and you're gonna see i'll prove it to you um, and then we'll talk about this, okay? So I'm gonna, <coughs> I'm gonna cut it for tonight, y'all. I'm so sorry. I, I hate that you had to watch me like cough and hear me talk nasally and stuff. Thank you for the love. Thank you for the uh, thoughts. I'm okay. I just, I gotta, I probably have a couple more days to get this out um, and get these meds to like, I guess, heal my body, kill whatever virus this is or whatever it is I have. And um, next week, will be full blast because Black Friday, Cyber Monday is coming up. Get ready. I'm going to show you a very short-term opportunity. It's not short, short, short-term, but it is not something that's going to last forever. So it's not, you know, something that you're going to build a massive business out of. It's something that you could potentially cash in on um, while it's hot and it's available and be the first or upon the first people to ride this wave. Gotta, if you're a surfer, you got to catch the wave while it's forming. You get the ride of your life. If you don't do that, you're going to grab a boogie board and swim out 10 feet into the water, and you're going to be eating dirt or eating sand, riding the, the, the end of those waves that literally just crash you into the, the shore, right? So be here next week. I love you all. Thanks for your thoughts. Uh, I'll, I know I'll be better by next week. And thanks for the congratulations. I'm so excited uh, to be an ad. And Casey's excited to be a mom, so um, she really appreciates your comments as well. And we'll see you next week on the Profit Power Hour. Okay, that's it for tonight. Love you all. I wish you a ton of success. Be here next week. I got something really special for you. All right, good night.